Hello and welcome back to the channel. My name is Ujaha and in this video we are talking about NFTs. Now, usually I talk more about DeFi and various other aspects of crypto. You know, I've got a few NFT channels, uh, videos on my channel. I do like NFTs. Um, I do, however, think, you know, there are some cons with them. Uh, and, you know, today what I really want to just briefly talk about, just going to be a quick video today, is just kind of how NFT volume has pretty much gone to zero. If you go to OpenSea, which is the largest kind of uh, NFT platform, you can see here how the volume over the last 24 hours for pretty much everything has gone significantly down. Liquidity is gone, essentially. Um, and, you know, you can you only need to scroll as far as rank 13 before you've got less than 100 ETH in volume. And, you know, not long ago, we were seeing multiple thousands of ETH being traded every single day. You know, we're at a tenth of that now. 90 plus percent of the volume is gone. Uh, and, you know, you can see that in the floor prices of some of these assets as well. You know, Mutant Ape Yacht Clubs used to have a 38, 30 ETH plus floor. Uh, and that was back when ETH was worth probably more than what it is right now. So uh, that's uh, not very good to see. And, you know, BAYC, that was definitely... A, 150 ETH at one point in time. Uh, now, sadly, below 80. Uh, and you know, as you scroll down, you'll see doodles at 7.6 ETH. You know, some of these are were huge at one point in time. Uh, and you know, this this is another one, Cool Cats. That was one that was above 10. I think it even went close to 20 ETH. It's uh, had a 90% drawdown in price. So, uh, yeah, volume is pretty much gone. Um, it's pretty difficult, uh, in my opinion, to make money with NFTs now, unless you get ridiculously lucky or you've managed to get yourself on a very, very hyped uh, whitelist of which there aren't that many anymore. These NFTs that were just launching every single week and people were just printing ETH, it's just not there anymore. The market is not there for it. Uh, NFT Twitter has kind of died down as well, in my opinion. Uh, and, you know, I think people are really realizing now that most of these NFTs are actually worth zero. Most of them will go to zero. Uh, most of them offer absolutely nothing. Most of them are just a picture. Um, and, you know, a picture is not worth one ETH or two ETH or five ETH for that matter. Uh, it's worth generally a lot less you know i know some of these um uh collections will say they offer a lot more than just a picture some of them will offer a community a game uh maybe some access to something ultimately my experience most of them are pretty awful and yeah we'll probably will carry on seeing some of these nft collections go down in price um for me i'm really interested in seeing the ones that have kind of stood the test of time somewhat of course you know nfts have only really been around for a short period of time nfts haven't even existed through a bear market so let's see which ones will survive the bear market and of those i wonder which ones will actually do well in the near future uh you know we've got some of these you know the biggest ones of all time i mean if we just look at all time uh, I think these will kind of tell you how how big some of these collections really are. Uh, the Punks, the Apes, uh, Azuki, Clone X, Moonbirds, Doodles, Cool Cats. So, uh, I think it will be really interesting to see how they all perform in the near future. Uh, you know, especially in the next, or maybe not even just the near future, but maybe in the next few years. Uh, really just to see if any of them come back. I think some of these ones in the top 50 are probably worth keeping your eye on because they were the ones with the biggest hype, the biggest volume, the you know the biggest influences, etc. Uh, and therefore, these projects may have the biggest treasuries and the biggest, uh, you know, the most amount of money essentially to keep themselves running for the near future or, or for the future. So that that's definitely what I've got my eye on. But if you're asking me what I'm buying, absolutely not. I'm not buying anything in this market, uh, and that's because. I think we're in the bear market and the bear market can get pretty brutal. Right now we're just seeing the volume go down. I think soon we'll see, you know, we will see floor prices really, really go to zero. I think a lot of them are worth zero. So that time, in my opinion, is coming. I could be completely wrong at the end of the day. Don't take my advice. I'm just a random guy on the internet. This is not financial advice at all. Um, Let's see what happens. But yeah, just a quick one. Just one to cover kind of NFTs in the marketplace at the moment. It's not looking good. But yeah, I'll be back with another video soon.